Hey guys, it's Kim again, and I am here with Cloud and Bobby's litter, and we're gonna do the biosensor training. So we're gonna get going here. We just did our scent training real quick, so now we're gonna do this. Hopefully I won't get yelled at too much. They're kind of fussing at me today. But once again, we have our five stress points. Oh, you know what I need? I need a Q-tip. Miss Danny, can you grab me a Q-tip, please? I forgot the Q-tip to do for your paws. This is little Matilda. Isn't she adorable? Look at her. Say hi, my name's Tilda. Thank you very much. Okay, all right. So once again, we start off with our doing our on our paws. A little bit of touching, a little bit of touching. What do you think, babe? We hold them up. You're so good, girl. You're so little. You're so little. Hold them down. On their back. There you go, girl. And once again, on a little bit of a cold compress or ice pack, whichever you want to call it. All right, so tilt. All right, little one. Okay, sweet baby, you ready? You really ready? Okay. Everybody gets to get it. Now, once again, the purpose of all this is just basically to strengthen their immune system, strengthen their adrenal glands, teaching them how at a very early age, just to put them under just a little touch of stress so they learn how to deal with it, right? Because we sure know you guys are gonna be having a stressful life at some point in time. At some point in time, we all do, right? It's funny because it's, nobody ever really teaches dogs coping skills and that's really what a lot of what this does and really a lot of what we do um, in what we do. We teach them how to cope, we teach them how to handle it because if we can teach them how to handle it, we have a much happier dog, right? We have a much happier puppy. Are you gonna be little girl? Are you little girl, baby? Is that good girl? Yeah. That's funny, they're all, their eyes were open. They're so small, we waited to do um, the videos for them until they got just a little bit bigger because they were just there, she had really, really small babies. So it's weird, usually we do this and their eyes aren't open, so it's kind of strange seeing it. All right, so we go, hey, you guys had you all lined up of who I did and who I didn't do. So now I have to try to remember, and that's not a good thing. Huh. Say, that's not a good thing for me. Say, my memory's not very good. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Kids, are you ready? Puppy breath. <coughs> puppy breath. We have puppy breath. You're so cute. Look at this little face. Look how adorable she is. You're such a cute baby. How come you're such a cute baby? Mommy, you made pretty babies. You made pretty babies. You really did. But you made lots of girls. Oh. But I wonder if that's probably the same as in, in people, right? The dad determines the sex. Mm -hmm. So Mr. Bobby did. Mr. Bobby made lots of girls. All right, Pumpkin. We're getting happy. We're getting happy, Yuli. Yes, you are. You're getting. Is that because you're a fat belly? Is that because you have a fat belly? You good boy. You are a good boy. Look at you. Oh my goodness. We're not having any squawkers. We're actually doing really well. Now that I said that, watch. You'll see. We'll find somebody that's going to squawk. We're going to find somebody that's going to. Nobody's fighting everything. They're actually very, very calm into this. Maybe the sage is true. Maybe they'll all be calm. <laughs> Except for who is it? Marsha? Was it Marsha? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It didn't like the sage. So, Marsha, we're going to have to work on you. All right, let's see who else we have down here. I hope I'm hitting everybody because you know what? I'm not paying attention right now. I'm not paying attention. Hi, sweet pea. Hi, sweet pea. You see, you're so pretty. You're so pretty and you're so little. Which means I'm having lots of fun. I know, I know. You're going to get to start your water. And we'll actually start the water conditioning with them very, very soon. We just want to be a little bit bigger. Um, we usually would have started it by now, but since this is such a small litter, um, we've kind of held off. Let's see who's over here. Did I do Stuart? I did Stuart. Did Yui. I did Matilda. We did this one. Lila. Lila, did I do you? <laughs> I did not do Lila. Let's get you find you, Lila. Where are you? You're purple, you're purple, where's purple? We're missing Lila. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, I did, there she is. You were telling me you were there, huh? So you were telling me, you were telling me. 
So what, as I was saying, we're waiting just a little bit longer, get them a little bit bigger before we pop them in the water yet because we have to be super careful when we do that um, that water doesn't get in their ears. Um, and their ears actually aren't even open yet. They've got about a little bit longer. They're still a little bit tight. Usually three weeks and these guys are just two weeks right now. So we got about another week before they open. Very good. And that is our biosensor program, guys. Thanks for watching.